right, well, we're gonna go ahead and get started. Maida, do you wanna share with us what you've got going over there? Yeah, sure. I'm going to show you some updates that we have made in IDX Sarons. And this is for IDX Broker. So I'm going to start with the single property websites. We just released a pro version that I'm going to talk about in a couple of minutes. But in case you don't know what a single property website is, it's a way or an app that we designed where you can display your feature listings and it works with IDX Broker. They are secure, easy to change, and they run really fast. And you can customize them with your logo, email. You can also add some scripts like a tracking pixel, etc. We are offering this app for free to our uh, clients. They look something like this. So it's going to show like all the information of one of your featured properties. And we have uh, two templates. One is the default one that it's on the left and a luxury one that it's part of this pro version that we are offering. Okay, so this pro version is going to, well, you can read more information about all the, about the single property websites on this link. If you open it, it's going to show something like this and you are going to be able like to like read all the information, see a video, uh, review some demos, uh, see all the features that are included. And here we have like a comparison chart with what's included in the pro version and in the default one. In this new version, we are uh, adding these four new things. You will be able to choose between different templates, add a custom domain to your single property website, add a virtual tour or, or and add a long form video. So I'm going to show you an example. This is on our demo account and here we have created five different single property websites. But now with this uh, pro feature, we have the option to change the design. I'm going to show you how it looks right now. It looks something like this. And now I have the option to change this design to the luxury one. And I need to save the changes so they are reflected on the website. And when I load this page again, it's going to show uh, this new template. Uh -huh. And we also have the option to add here in the media tab uh, two new things. One is a 3D tour. Let me show you an example. You can get these code snippets either from, I don't know, your 3D tour provider or from YouTube. And I'm also going to add a video. You can get also this type of uh, code snippets from YouTube. And I'm going to save the settings. So the website is updated. It's going to display the 3D tour here. And at the bottom, it's going to display a long form video. And you can start customizing more your single property websites. <laughs> and if you don't know, you can also embed here some, this is like a default uh, form that you, we are adding, it's a demo form, but you can add here a high level form. This is a high level form that was inserted uh, here. And finally, related to the custom subdomain, you can add here uh, a different domain. You only need like to point it to this IP address. <laughs> so these are the updates related to the single property websites, the pro version. I don't know if you have any comments or questions. Yeah, I, I have a quick question for you, Maida. So uh, how much are, th are these going to be? I mean, this is a paid, you have the free version and then this pro version is going to be paid. Yes, it's only going to be $9 per month. Mm -hmm. Is that going per to listing? No, it's for all your feature listings. Okay. Mm -hmm. And we're going to be adding more features like creating 
single property websites for the supplemental listings and also update them automatically. This is going to be made in the upcoming months. Okay, very good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that looks great. Okay. So one, one last question yeah. about that, Maida. If you decide you don't like that luxury template, can you click it back to the default one? Yeah, sure. I'm going to show you. So here we have the, this is the luxury one. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to switch back to the default one. I only need like to save the changes. And if I reload the page, it's going to be using the default uh, theme. Also with the same information that I had previously added. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks great. Thank you. Yeah, sure. Okay, this is related to the single property websites, the pro version. And now I want to show you something related to how to create a polygon search for a lead inside high level. There's going to be an option like this one, but I'm going to show you uh, inside our one of our high level accounts. So let's say you want to create a polygon search inside here, like your lead connector dashboard. What you would need to do for now is click here on the lead name and you are going to see the lead uh, information. Here on the Save It Searches tab, it's going to show all the Save It Searches of this particular lead. And now you are going to be able here to choose what type of Save It Search you want to create. And here we have the Polygon Search. If you create it, it's going to show like a map where you are going to be able to select the area or the polygon where you want to create this search, but you need to assign a name. So I'm going to make a test and create it in downtown Miami uh, luxury condos. And I'm going to select this area. Mm -hmm. And here you can also select other things like the property type. Right now I'm going to only select condos and I'm going to add a price. Let's say up to 500,000. And I'm going to save the polygon search uh-huh. So it created the search for this lead. And I'm going to refresh the page for now, only to see that this was, I mean, it was created, but let's see that it's going to appear here on the dashboard. This is a new Save It Search that was created. So if I click on this link, I'm going to be able to see this polygon search that I just created for this list. And I also can see this uh, Save It Search that was created right now this one in the leads uh, profile inside IDX broker. We are still doing some tests, but it's uh, we are happy to show you this new update. Uh, so you can create different types of saved searches for your leads. And this is it. Uh, in case you have any comments or questions, you can send us an email to support at realtycandy.com. I don't know if you have any comments or questions. That looks good. So that that uh, Polygon map search functionality, that's available for free to anybody that's using our um, integration with high level and IDX broker. Is that right? Yes, that's right. OK, mm -hmm. that's really fantastic. Thank you. Sure, no problem. Thank you, thank you. Yes, thank you. Well, I want to show you the progress on Leader MLS uh, website. Um, this project is for investors and high level users. We want to be able to upload properties directly from your high level website and make a use high level as the CRM. So let me show you what are the main features. You can search for properties. You can register as a buyer and you can save properties and save searches. Let me create an, an account here. Let's 
going to use this email. Okay. I just created an account and I will have here my save listing, my save searches and my profile. I can start a uh, searching for properties and adding them as my save properties. Okay. And I also can create a, a new save search here with my, with my pa search parameters. Okay. What is doing in the backend is that you have already connected your high level account and when a new user registered on your website, it's going to create a new contact. So here we have an example and this contact will be updated when different actions uh, are made. For example, when you save a property, uh, a new node will be created on your user. Let me go for a, an example. Okay. This is the example that I was looking for. Um, as you can see here in the notes, we have a new safe search and using high level, we can send updates directly from this account. As you can see here, we have an email sending from, from high level using an, a workflow with the light, latest updates from a save search. And you can see uh, the history of the of the communication. Okay. Also, you will have here uh, how many properties they have searched, how many properties they have seen, and also the listing, the, the save search updates. Here, I want to show you that you can customize the email template. If you go to market marketing and email templates, you will be able to customize your template as you wish. And this is the workflow that is going to be sent, sending emails, updates, or save search updates. And this is what I wanted to show you, um, a way to send market uh, email marketing uh, updates directly from high level using leader MLS. Very nice, Carlos. So let me ask you just a quick, couple quick questions about this. Um, what kind of a website is this that you're showing this Cancun coastline realty? This is a high level website, as you can see here. So you can, you can run this on any high level website. Is that what you're saying? Yes, exactly. Any high level website, you just need to add a, a small line of code in order to make it work. What about if we're using WordPress, for example, what it, do we need something different for WordPress? No, we can use the same lines of code uh, and the software is going to, to be rendered on WordPress, Wix, or any platform. Okay, cool. Cool, and it'll load all the, it loads all this information back into high level, then you can make any kind of automations you want, I guess, yeah. right? Exactly. Okay, that's fantastic. And is it, are you guys done with this? Or you, you're still working on some other features, aren't you, that you're gonna be adding in here? Yes, we are still working on uh, other emails. Uh, for for example, when you save a property, you, you want to receive updates if the price has changed and those type of features we are working on. Okay, yeah, it sounds great. Well, I really appreciate you showing this to us. Um, 
And I guess you'll be showing us some more goodies next week too, right? Yes, for sure. Okay, cool. Hey, thanks so much for sharing that, Carlos. I really appreciate it. Thank you.